Hello everybody, welcome to Maps Image Maker channel. This is Toshiyagi from beautiful little island Okinawa, Japan. Hey, this is Okinawan scenery. Each side of the beach. Well, Pacific Ocean Beach, huh? Uh, this is my subject today and uh, I have this pencil drawing type image by Adobe Photoshop used to filter cold fine edges. And uh, I painted this, I colored yesterday actually from this black and white image to add color. Then I think this is, mm, I, I want a little bit more thick color so I just dupli uh, duplicate this color layer. Blend mode is color. Just add this. But I tone down to 60%. This is a little bit too much to me, so I just tone down about 60, but uh, it is fine. Yeah, pretty much. So I'm gonna, uh, well, merge down. Then we have this original image, original black and white, and colored image. Today's original uh, base image. Then I'm gonna change this pencil drawing type image, blend mode. Let's get started. Okay, change this blend mode to like color burn. That's pretty cool. Linear burn. Well, color burn is nice. Yeah, this is the one of the way. And also I have, let's see, this lum luminosity is pretty nice. Nice saddle colors. I think this luminosity image for some kind of pastel colors then color burn this one is for maybe oil paint type image base color so i want to make two of them two variations from these images to get this image fixed as a one layer make group of three images make group then duplicate this group then flatten this image yeah okay then turn it off this group image this is one layer of well pencil drawing with color brown effect so I'm gonna rename okay now we got this base color image fixed on one layer then let's see just oil paint well this is procreate so let's see what i can do from here this is nice let me see turn it on this pencil drawing type image then change this to normal i just want to see Pencil drawing type image. I'm going to change this linear burn gets darker because we have this pencil drawing type image. Now change this to hard light, linear light, pin light. Hmm? These are pretty interesting. Well, this is nice too. Well, about now, color burn effect, base color image, change blend mode to pin light, which is pretty interesting. Yeah, nice clear image. This is some kind of illustration type image, I like that. Yeah, I want to fix this image too. I kind of like this kind of image. Let me see if I move this image all the way bottom. Then bring this one 
blend mode to normal. Then pencil drawing tab image. Change normal to overlay, which is pretty closer to the image that we saw just now. If I tone down overlay effect, it's kind of nice. Pretty close, a little more detail, but hmm. Yeah, pencil drawing type image noise, huh? Well, okay. I don't know. I just want to compare. So, I'm going to bring this one back. Then, change blend mode to... First of all, this pencil drawing type image. Bring back to normal 100%. Then, change this to pin light. Now I just want to keep this. Okay, just keep this image in light. Yeah, 100% max. Then uh, pencil drawing type image. Two layers. Okay, keep this image. Alright, I just kept this image. Now I want to change this one back to, well, linear light. This is nice too. I can get so many variations from this just change blend mode. Look at this. Color and move this original black and white image. Bring this one up. Then turn it on. Now change to color burn. Get so darker on luminosity effect layer. Pretty much pretty interesting too. On down, maybe about 50. So cool, huh? Or let's see, color burn change to pin light. No more image. This one goes to real dark. This is cool too. Divide 50%. Yeah, this is nice. Okay, I want to keep this one too. Original image, divide 50% over color burn image. Yeah, I kept this image. Now we have two different vari variations. Now I'm going to bring this one back to normal. This is cool. Change blend mode, opacity. Okay, turn it off, black and white. Now we have this color burn effect layer. Color base image. Now, what do we can do from here? Okay, now we got the contrast of the colors. Looks like somewhere else in the world, huh? I don't know if I like this much contrast. Well, I'm gonna keep this one too. I have another two different variations. So we got uh, three, four images from this colorized image. Well, that's all about it for today, huh? We see some different variations. I'm gonna open up some images to get together to look at it. Maybe that doesn't much big difference, huh? Let's see if we can open the image though. Well, we'll just keep this one or one variation. Then one more inside photo. One, two, three, four. Now we got the four different ones. Now select one, two, three, four, five, four, then uniform. About this much, yeah? Okay, this is one, this is three. This one is two. Okay. 
Yeah. Now we'll open it up. Look at four of them. This one is first one. Then second one I kept this. Then third. This one is last one. Oh no. One, two, three, four. That's right. Pretty much contrast, huh? First one just colorized. Then I add effect. Then different color burn effect. This is the last one. Well, that's it for today and uh, three different variations. Now, what are we gonna get? Something interesting image? Well, these are the images. Now decide to use. What are you gonna use? Well, thank you for watching my movie and uh, I hope this movie is gonna give you some kind of idea for your creative work and uh, mm, that's kind of fun. Yeah, I really appreciate for you guys' support and uh, you guys have a nice day. Let's be creative and uh, just try on something different. Then look at it. Well, thank you and uh, you guys have a nice day and see you next time. Bye now. Ciao.